ablation is indeed a, a one of my passions in interventional on oncology image guided therapy. So you are asking me the minimum requirements for ablation with a curative intent to treat a tumor. So the way I think about it is that we need to reach the same outcome for surgery. So how do we achieve that? The first thing is that we have to have uh, adequate uh, imaging equipment so we can actually depict, see well, the tumor, which is our target. Second requirement is that we have to have the tools to be able to target that tumor with our tools, in this particular case, the ablation electrode, to be in the position we want it to be in order to treat the target tumor. And the third requirement that comes together is to be able intraprocedurally to see the ablation zone created by our tools and at the end be able to confirm that the target tumor has been completely treated with the desired ablation margin covering the target tumor and be as much as we can with the tools that we have today to say at the end of the procedure that all tumor cells have been killed, there is no viable tumor remaining in our treatment zone, and we have covered with the desired margin. The reason that the acclaim trial has been conceptualized, it was because we have seen in prior work that whenever we were able to treat colorectal cancer liver metastasis, which is the acclaim trial four, and we had a margin of over five millimeters and ideally over 10 millimeters, our local tumor control is similar, if not better, than wedge resection uh, for the same disease. What we're trying to do uh, through the Society of Interventional Oncology is to raise the bar, create a minimum standard throughout different countries and different centers in the world with that trial, which is a phase two prospective trial enrolling about 325 patients in roughly three years throughout several centers in the United States and Europe for the moment, we hope to prove that indeed ablation should and can reach the same outcome with limited resection for small colorectal liver metastasis. The ACLAIM trial is designed in a way that really can move from a clinical trial to a standard of care. I would like to uh, remind to everybody that it's really critical uh, that we actually work together, standardize our practice, and try to create evidence with our research, with clinical trials, that indeed IR treatment has a very good outcome that is comparable if not better than alternatives, and prove our value for the healthcare systems that become more complex. I strongly believe that interventional radiology has solutions for many, many problems, and unfortunately, uh, we are not as well known. We have not shown that enough uh, to the patient and to the healthcare payer. And I think every effort we do uh, should be directed to show what we can do and how our outcomes compare with alternative treatments so we can be chosen when indeed we provide good quality care with a very good outcome.